I am Anir Bantal, and I'm the Assistant Professor of Mechanical Engineering at the College of Engineering of Essex and m University. Okay. And where did you grow up? I grew up in a town called Jamshedpur, which is in India. Uh, it was a steel town, and uh, my dad worked in an uh, automotive industry plant. And what motivated you to teach? Well, since I grew up, I think everybody has a certain curiosity. And from that curiosity stems a certain, I guess, a lust for learning. And that learning is also associated with a certain kind of joy. And that is something I hugely enjoy. So I enjoy learning a lot. And I believe that is what uh, spurred me into teaching because sharing is, teaching is a way of sharing the joy of learning. Why did you come to WT? Um, so when I was looking for positions, uh, I was looking for positions uh, in engineering and I found a good opportunity here. I like this place here. Um, I personally am not a huge fan of very urban environments because they tend to get very crowded. They tend to get very high traffic-y, I guess. So, and I, I wanted to uh, be in a place where uh, there isn't that much traffic, honestly. Uh, so th this the Panhandle area has that kind of a charm to it, and uh, and I like that. And outside of the classroom, what are your biggest hobbies? Uh, well, I do like to dance a lot. Um, so I do. Uh, I've been dancing Argentine tango for a really long time, about 10, 12 years so far. That's a passion I still continue cultivating. Um, and I also like dancing salsa and swing. So. Um, I just like dancing a lot. And how did you get into that hobby? Well, when I started my grad school in upstate New York, um, I was focusing on my graduate school, but and I knew that it was going to be very intensive uh, from an academic standpoint. And I really, really wanted to do something new, something, uh, I guess, something outside of the curriculum. And I, I tried a lot of different things. Uh, but uh, uh, Argentine tango was one of those things. And once I started it, I really got into it because it has a lot of musicality. Uh, there's a rich music history to it. Uh, the dancing has a lot of mechanical mechanics involved. So from an engineering standpoint, it can be very appealing. Um, so all those factors. Uh, and there's also something very human about dancing that I believe. And uh, so all these things combined got me really interested and invested in that hobby. And are you planning to any like, other type of dances you want to learn? Uh, I'm trying to get better at salsa. Uh, there's a dance that I'm learning, that I'm learning. It's called Lindy Hop, which is a kind of swing dance. It's kind of an older jazzy swing dance from probably the 1930s and 40s. And uh, that is something that I'm on the, on the learning path. I'm still learning Argentine tango and salsa, but uh, Lindy Hop Swing is probably one of those that I am at the most beginner level at. How much does that take up of your time, like dancing? Oh, how much of my time? Uh, well, I try to spend at least two to three hours every week on that, if not more. Any other hobbies that you do? I do... Well, this is a hobby that I want to get invested in. Um, I'm also interested in uh, Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu. I'm also interested in rock climbing, but I haven't had the chance to spend enough time on it. So hopefully next coming fall, I might be investing in either of those two, but not both. And is there a reason why you just want to go into those? Um, I guess it has to do with the movement. I'm really fascinated by by how your body can move and I feel like in the current environment you don't get the opportunity to move in many different ways because you could sit on your chair and live most of your day uh, well actually um, and and so I feel like the body is a really important resource that is underutilized and so I like I, I, I get drawn to activities in which you, you're using your body in relatively unique ways uh, rock climbing is definitely one of them and Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu is, again, another one of them. Very different, but it's just ways of using your body in different ways. So I would say, like, you, you don't like just being sitting down. So yeah. Just, like, moving around. Yeah. Um, 
I mean, I, I can be sedentary. I do like playing video games, <laughs> so I, I can be sedentary at times, but I, I want to get be in the um, process of, I guess, I guess I want to stay young to some extent. Okay, I, mean, I, I need to know, what kind of video games do you like? <laughs> well, I recently was playing, so I have a very old graphics card, and probably who doesn't? Um, and so the only, the only games I can play are older than uh, 2015. <laughs> so I play really old video games. Um, so recently I was playing Metal Gear Solid 5. Uh, so that's a game that I enjoyed. And lately, uh, the most recent game that I've been playing is Mirror's Edge, which also has a lot of parkour in it, which is also interesting. <laughs>